Ugh. What a mess. Unacceptable. Okay, time to go to work. Monster. 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 Okay, it just started raining, just when I started washing the car. But I'm not gonna stop, I'm gonna keep washing, because there's a car show tomorrow, and I'm gonna keep washing my car. <laughs> Yeah, it looks really nice. You done a really good job. Thanks. Yeah. Was it rusty at all when you... Oh, it was really bad. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if you know much about these cars, but the heater channels always go, so it's like the yeah. whole front to back, and then there's a patch panel like that, and right. then all around the luggage area. Yeah. And then the car was cut off from here back, so all this is new. You can actually still see me, my, uh, my welds right there. Oh, yeah. It's so clean. Did you just finish it or? Uh, it's got 2,500 2, miles on it, something like that. Does it keep up with traffic? Oh yeah, oh yeah. It's got quite a bit more power yeah. than it would have had. Different uh, cams or? Yeah, cam, uh, actually not, not a lot different. Uh, pretty much just board yeah. uh, to a 94 mil piston, so it's a 1914. And then uh, I got an Engel 110 cam, which is kind of mild street. Yeah. And then, of course, the massive Weber IDAs. Yeah, I thought those were Webers, yeah. <laughs> they are so valuable now. Yeah. Yeah. My dad's had those for years. So you got a lot of induction for this small motor, that's for sure. Yeah, well, I took it to the drag strip one time, and it runs, uh, I mean, like, not crazy fast, but yeah. 15.5 at... Uh, that's pretty good. That's about as fast as my FRS. Yeah. This is, this is so cool. And these are the stock rims? No, those are kind of a 356 copy. Yeah. They look bigger than the stock rims too, right? Yeah, they're five and a half. Yeah. Are they still 15 or? 15, five and a half, yeah. So it wouldn't have come with 15s when I was new, would it? It would have. It uh, would have. 15 and four and a half inch oh. wide. But I, I kind of wanted to mimic that 356 look. Right. Well, Even it though, looks yeah. good. Yeah. Is this a stock color? Yeah. It looks uh, like a stock color. I don't know why they only did it one year. 1960 only. Yeah. But it was, the car was originally black. Yeah. 
but my dad has a black car and I've tried to take care of that thing. It's, it's yeah, no, I think the color shows up that the line's really good. Yeah. Yeah, it this is smooth. Th this car was actually painted in a two-car garage. Yeah. Have a look inside here. They used to be all copper coated. Yeah. And it was originally white, like this? Yeah, all that was ivory painted, kind wow. of. Yeah. And the, the, are these reproductions? Reproductions, but the original style. Wow, I didn't know all this stuff was available for these cars. Yeah, it's crazy. Yeah. There's a place in Richmond that stocks pretty much everything you need. It sounds awesome, it yeah. holds nice, and it's a yeah. car. You've done a fantastic job. All right. Awesome. Okay. Well, see you around. Yeah, see ya. All right. There's a young guy who has completely restored this classic bug by himself. And you can see that it's a labor of love. Awesome. from last week?
What an awesome get together. And it was great to meet some very cool car people. Please subscribe for more and I will see you next time.